Hello world, welcome back to Subway 23's Thought Experiment. Here on this lovely evening of October 1st, I'm starting a new tutorial series on creating a dynamic scalar and rotation system for the HoloLens. What do I mean by dynamic? Now one major part of working with Unity is the Mono Behavior Base class. An element of that class requires scripts designed to affect an, a game object to be attached to that object. Um, let's take a quick look at the uh, cursor manager here. And you'll see here that one thing that all game objects have is a transform. Um, but aside from that transform, we see the cursor manager script. And this is just a standard C sharp script that's attached to the object. Um, so the goal of the dynamic system is to loosen this requirement uh, in order to allow objects to be added on the fly and then for them to be uh, for work correctly. So as you see, I just added three objects. I'm going to hit play. And then when I select those objects, we can see that they are working within our uh, scalar system. So we have a selection box and eight handles uh, around the box that will be used for scaling and possibly for rotation. We may add something separate to rotate with. But um, that's the goal of this tutorial series. Uh, and let's get started. All right, first things first, make sure you have the Hollow uh, Toolkit downloaded and extracted to your desktop or somewhere easy to get to. Um, I'll put a, a link uh, in the description uh, to get to the Hollow Toolkit. Um, start Unity and create a new project. And we're going to, I'm calling this Scale. And Rotsis. And then I'll create a project. And once the new project loads up, we need to take all the files from the asset subfolder of the Hollow Toolkit. So select all of this. You can deselect examples. We don't really need that. And then we want to drag all of this to the assets folder inside our project view. Now, this will take some time um, while it goes through its process. And abracadabra. Here we are. Um, if you get any errors uh, or warnings after it finishes installing the, the hollow toolkit, just hit the clear button on the console. Uh, that shouldn't shouldn't be an issue. Um, so now we need to save the scene. So first we're going to go to File, Save Scene As, and here we right click, hit New, Folder, Type Scenes, hit Enter, and then we're going to type Main. So you'll see down here in the project view, it created the scenes folder so we can get to our main. Um, so now that we're, we're ready to go, uh, we need to do a, a couple of quick changes. We're going to add a few things from the hollow toolkit. The first one we're going to do is we're going to select the main camera from our hierarchy view and hit the delete key. Uh, and we now no longer have a camera. So now we need to go to hollow. We need to dig into hollow toolkit um, utilities and then prefabs, and we'll just drag main camera into our scene. And now we've got a camera again. Uh, this one just has a few things that are very specific to the HoloLens: uh, the 16 degree field of view, black background, solid color, uh, and the clipping plane ch is changed. Uh, next up, we need to add in the cursor. Uh, we're going to go Hollow Toolkit, Input, Prefabs, and we will drag the cursor into our scene. And this is the same cursor that y'all saw earlier. Same cursor manager. All right. So now we need to add 
what's going to be our manager object. Uh, we will attach most of our management scripts to this object. So we'll hit create empty. Let's name it manager. And then we're going to click on add component. Move down to scripts. Hollow toolkit unity. And we need to check, uh, we need to get our gaze manager. We're going to do that again, but this time we're looking for the gesture manager. And one more time, script for the hand manager. All right. And with that, we're going to call this tutorial done. This was the getting started. We've got everything we need set up so that we can actually start doing the work. Coming up next, we're going to learn how to draw boxes um, from script around other objects. Um, that one may be a bit intense, may take a couple of episodes to get through. Uh, it's all scripting. Um, but uh, we'll see in that one. Make sure and stick around. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. Make sure you share it. And uh, I appreciate it. Uh, also, check out my Patreon. Uh, see you on the next one. Bye. La, la, la.